animal vocabulary. This is animal, so it's kind of like wings. So take your tiny hand, and then you move your arm. Animal. Bird. So it's like a little bird poopy. Cat. Um, a lot of animal signs, you can do them with two hands or one. So cat, like it's pointing at the whiskers. And I keep my fingers up because it looks like it has more whiskers. Dog, so the old way for dog was you hit your thigh and you like you slap it like you're calling a dog and like snap without really making a sound. Dog. Um, but now they've shortened it to just the snap. Because D O G is dog. And if you do this fast, it's like you're doing D O G. Just fast. Eagle, so it's like the hook of the beak, eagle. Giraffe, so it goes up. Make sure you go above your head for giraffe. Um, if you go too soon, it kind of looks like throw up. So giraffe. Owl. Two O's around your eyes, like an owl. And they have big eyes. Bear. So it's kind of like love, but with claws, and you like scratch hair. Cow. It's a cow. Like the horns of a cow. You can do it one handed cow. Monkey, so scratch like under your armpits like you would if you were acting like a monkey. Pig, so pig is closed by his hand and you bend your fingers under your chin. Dirty is you wiggle your fingers, so dirty pig. Sheep, so you take your arm, palm up. I'm usually seeing with a fist, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, and then you take your fingers like scissors, and you would go like against your arm, like you're shearing a sheep. Sheep. Deer or moose. So this is deer. It can also be moose, but I've seen moose comes out because a moose has bigger antlers than a deer. So deer, moose, elephant. So you make a C come from your nose. It's an elephant trunk fish, so you take your hand and kind of have it swim back and forth. Horse, so it can be two hands, so like horse's ears. Skunk, so this is the middle finger, and it goes over your head like this. Lion is a C, and it goes like this, like for the mane. So this is lion, and this is skunk. Similar, but you just need to be careful. <laughs> um, sorry, I lost my thing. Tiger. So tiger is like the stripes on the face. Zebra is stripes on your chest, on your body. They're different. Chicken, so bird, and then like your pecking. Bird, pecking. Trick question. Goat. Um, so it's like a fist from your chin, and it goes up for like the horns. So like they have the little goat beard for goat. Kangaroo, so like hop hop, it's kind of like you're holding the pouch, I guess, and then you hop, kind of bounce it. Mouth, so it's your pointer finger, and it goes just a little on your nose. This is also fake. So for a mouse, I do it like smaller because the mouse is small, so you think of it like that. Snake, um, there is another way to do it, but the one I've seen the most is bent V coming from your mouth, snake, and it kind of slithers. Snake. Turkey, so a Q, and it goes under your chin and kind of wiggles turkey. Duck, so it's like bird, but a bigger beak duck. Fox, so an F, and then it goes like on your nose and twists. Fox. Rabbit, there's a few ways to do rabbit, but I do this way, so it's like two Z's or two U's, and they move like little rabbit ears. Squirrel or chipmunk, so you take bent V's and like knock them together, knock the knuckles together, uh, like a squirrel or a chipmunk breaking the nut to eat. Turtle, so you take your thumb, put your thumb down and cover it, and you can wiggle it like a turtle in a shell. 
and then Zhu. I've seen the sign for Zhu as you hold the hand up and draw a Z, but Zhu is such a short word. So it's Zhu. Z O O. That's the easiest way. Alright, that's it for animal vocabulary.